Some people collect baseball cards or figurines, but for one Albuquerque woman, her collection stands out as one of the weirdest in the state. She has collected so many cookbooks over the years, she's had to move to a bigger house. Here's News 13's Haley Rush to show you. There it is. It's hard to choose just one. But for Sue Jimenez, this cookbook from 1925 is definitely one of her favorites. Marjorie says the well-fed man is a happy man and a very easily managed one too. Every book she has here. Most of these books that I have are out of print. Or here. I've got them organized by continent, starts with Africa. Is more than a collection. You can learn a surprisingly amount of incredible information by reading a cookbook if you really take the time. Instead of fiction, she reads cookbooks. It's a lot of history, a lot of history. And she shelves so many. I currently have 4,649 books in the collection. It makes her the Guinness World Record holder. There's another one of my favorites uh, down here. Most are used coming from thrift stores. I've got a book from Kazakhstan that I can't really read because it's, it's in Kazakhstan. In every category you could imagine. And then I have a section down here in politics. Her house full of cookbooks comes from her obvious love. Cooking, of course, in addition to the cookbooks, is my hobby. I love cooking. And with books organized on shelves. And then it starts into Europe, and I, you know, start with mm -hmm. France, Italy. Stretching from the ceiling to floor. There's another one of my favorites uh, down here. Jimenez says it's not about the world record, but what story each cookbook tells. However charming, must be managed, and let us feed him well first and manage him afterwards. Uh, the Guinness Book of World Records recently released their list of weirdest records held in each state. Jimenez won in New Mexico. This is Jimenez's second cookbook collection in her life.